What is up y'all, it is your boy Zay, back again with another unboxing video. Now if you guys did not see my community tab, um, I posted a sneak peek of what I got at Hot Topic the other day. So, I have them both in here. Yep, there's two items in here. And we're gonna sh showing them off, one each. Excuse me. Um, I just had some water, so I apologize for that. <laughs> um, so the first thing, the first of the two I want to show that I got from Hot Topic is, first of all, these are Funko Pops. These are Funko Pops that weren't supposed to be coming out until June of this year, but for some reason, GameStop nor Newberry Comics at the mall I was in, at the mall I was in, Newberry Comics and GameStop did not have any of these pops in. So I was like, huh, because I went to those stores after because I wanted to see if they had more than just two of these characters. So Hot Topic had only two of them. And in total, they're supposed to be coming out with uh six. Yes, yeah, six in total, plus a GameStop exclusive, which counts so which is still six in total so only one pop isn't is exclusive and that's a GameStop exclusive now the first pop I am going to show you of the two is the Marvel Spider-Man 2 Peter Parker slash Spider-Man in his advanced suit 2.0 2.0 suit the main suit of Spider-Man 2 that he wears. And he has his little, um, iron spider legs out. Now, this pop is so cool looking. It's so cool looking. I love it. And as soon as I saw this, I was like, you know what? I have to fucking get this. Because this suit is so much better than what they did originally. With the original advanced suit from the first game, and when it returned in um, Miles Morales, yeah, total upgrade. I love the colors of the suit, the legs are badass in the game, they look badass here in pop form. So this pop is a common, he's not an exclusive to any store, you can get him anywhere. Like I said, I got him at Hot Topic. So... And then I asked the lady, the register, the lady at the register, I asked her, how did you guys get these in a whole month early? Because these things don't come out until June. So, and she was like, I don't know. She was pretty much just like, I don't know. <laughs> so, I don't know, but thank you, Hot Topic, for getting these in <laughs> early. So, and we got the box. It's part of the uh, Marvel Gamerverse line of Funko Pops. Um, we got the picture of the pop right there. Side of the box, we get the full picture of the pop. Uh, uh, top. Half a uh, Spidey's mask, nothing more at the bottom. These were cheap, too. Like, look, look at this. Look at this. These were so cheap for brand new pops. I only paid twelve fifty for these. Twelve fifty Altogether, that's like, what, 20, 24 bucks? So... Here's the back. Yeah, here's what I'm talking about. Yeah, so they had, um, you know, I'm not even going to spoil who the next pop is that I'm going to be unboxing. But the only two that are missing in here are is the GameStop exclusive Miles Morales Spider-Man in his uh, Evolve suit, which I don't think a lot of people are getting because that suit is so fugly. <laughs> it's so ugly looking. And the only reason why that suit even exists in this, I guess you could say, Marvel Spider-Man universe, is because they uh, Adidas wanted, I, I guess, a sponsor. And if you look, if you go in Times Square, okay, if you go in Times Square in Marvel Spider-Man Two, they uh, have this little store, and from outside the store, you can see the inside. You can't go inside the store, which kind of stinks, but. Inside the store from the outside view, you can 
look inside the store and it's an Adidas store. And they got like Adidas products in there, like sweaters, shoes, and the shoes that Miles wore for his Evolve suit were sponsored by Adidas. So, uh, I don't know, that, that suit is so, like, fucking ugly. I, I don't like it. I'm sorry, Insomniac. You could have done something way better as a Miles Morales original, <laughs> as how he said it in the game. It's time for a Miles Morales original, you know? <laughs> but, anyway, I digress. It is what it is. But, um, let me show you the rest of these, actually. And then they're also missing, uh... Peter Parker and hid the in the um black suit. You know, and specifically the black suit, not the symbiote suit when it's like full like almost venom mode, the black suit where 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 he first gets it after being spoiler alert stabbed by Craven and here he helps him, you know, give he gives him the symbiote to save his life pretty much. So that pop is also missing in here. Why are these two pops missing? I don't know, but we got uh, Miles in his new upgraded suit. Uh, we got Venom and Craven. Now, I'm obviously going to get the um, I'm obviously going to be getting what's it called? The black suit Spider-Man because it looks that cool. I'm going to be getting Craven, Venom and Miles. I'm getting all of them, except for the GameStop exclusive. Miles and the uh, Evolve suit. So, I, I'm just saying, they could have done something way better, man. But uh, enough wasted time, I'm going to get this pop opened up. So, let's go ahead and open this. Okay. Ooh, I love that new Funko Pop smell. And thank God this pop comes with a attachable base, meaning it cannot be removable, which is good because, you know, he's supposed to be leaping in the air with the iron legs. So because of that, he's going to need an attachable stand. Did I put this on right? I sure did. Okay. Alright, so put the box back there. Alright, so, here he is, oh my god, and of course, it's a Marvel pop, so he's gonna, he's gonna, he's got, uh, the bobblehead, which you can still rotate, but I choose not to rotate him, you know, cause that can cause, uh, damage to, like, the spring that, um, helps the head, the head's bobble, but yeah, look at this, and the arms are kinda wiggly, too, like, you guys see that? But I highly recommend don't move them too much because they're, from the looks of it and from the feel of them, they feel kind of fragile to the point where they can break. So if you guys are going to move these, like kind of like go like this like or like this, you know, gentle. Wouldn't it be crazy if they added like, like some articulation to the legs? Like that would be kind of cool. But that would be, I guess, asking for too much for one simple pop. But he looks good. You know, he looks really good with the iron legs. And I'm glad that they didn't give him the basic, you know, Spider-Man pose. This is so fucking cool. I love it. And I love the detail they put in the legs. You know, it's got some, it's got like the blue uh, hues of light. It would have been cool. If one or two of them had, like, the webs coming out, you know, because that, that's a skill that you can earn for um, Peter's skill tree. Because, you know, in the game, they give you three different types of uh, skill trees. You got Peter, Miles, and then both Peter and Miles. And for just Peter, there's a skill point for the Iron Legs where when they come out, the webs will will burst so it's not just gonna be like the lights bursting at the enemies it's gonna be that and the webs coming out so i don't know just just a suggestion but um 
this this pop is really cool. Here's a closer look at him. Yeah, look at that. This suit looks much better. So much better. And you can kind of see the back logo, like up t uh, up top, right there. <laughs> yeah, this is a cool looking pop, and I love it. So to compare them with, uh, sadly, I don't own any of the other Marvel Spider-Man pops. Sadly, I don't. I missed out. I, I missed my chance. But um, as far as I know, they are coming out with another one for the first game. It's going to be a... Uh, I think it's going to be an Amazon exclusive. I don't know if it's going to be common or exclusive, but they're going to release the Velocity suit from the first Spider-Man game alongside with the rest of these uh, Spider-Man 2 pops. So, will I be getting it? I don't know. I don't know. I, that, that suit was okay for me, so I don't, I don't know. But to compare this pop with other ones, I do have the Tobey Maguire pop standing next to him all right and then we got let's see we got tom holland in the red and blue suit aka the final swing suit from a uh, spider-man no way home and just putting these two side by side they look good together and i actually really love how Funko went the route and gave him the the webs, supposed of like the the Tom Holland ones, in the recently um release uh, Angel Garfield No Way Home pop. But uh, and here he is standing with his Marvel Legends counterpart. Had to <laughs> Hasbro version, Funko version, so. It's the same suit, but different companies. They're both the same advanced 2.0 suits. But one's an action figure, one's a bobble pop, bobblehead. So, yeah, thank you guys so much uh, for watching this video. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.